Hi everyone, my name is Raziel Kane. I'm back with another Toy Hacks review and today these decals will go on this fantastic figure uh, Bulkhead, which I was kind of understanding why the people were upset with not getting a toy ac no, a cartoon accurate version of Bulkhead. But then again, when Transformers Prime or Transformers Animated came out, I understand that the toy that came with the show was already accurate. So to get a G1 fight version of Bulkhead, uh, upsetting for you know a lot of uh, fans, but I'm happy to have this figure. It's uh, I did the review. He, he's looking good, fantastic. I bought the decals on a whim uh, because I don't think he really needs decals because like he's, he's already such a good mold and with the great paint application, but. I'm gonna apply them anyway, we're gonna take a, a look at them first and see how he turns out. So, because uh, I haven't looked at pictures on toyhacks.com that much, so... You know, I'm trying to not memorize what they look like with the decals, I just want to be surprised. So, uh, hopefully I will be pleasantly surprised this time. So before I do that, I want to invite you to take a look at my voice acting playlist, the main feature of my channel, something I'm very proud of. And also check out uh, my sponsor DJC Collectibles, and at the end of the video, you'll be able to get a 10% discount code for anything Transformers. So now let's just uh, roll out to the paint shop and see how this guy turns out. Any Autobot within 500 clicks will see the sky glowing with Energon and come running. Okay, here we go. Straight out of the box. You know, there's there was a whole debate about the mold and the toy accuracy and everything, but uh, we're past that now because this is a fantastic mold. Uh, even the uh, Wreck and Rule uh, repaint uh, was a big success. People really liked it. Uh, I kept his fist uh, because, you know, he's a warrior just leaving his balls out. And uh, he's going to look amazing because I took a look at the uh, the decals. Well, like I said, I have uh, extras um, for. It says labels for lift ticket. I don't have lift ticket, and uh, maybe lift ticket wasn't that popular, and they have leftovers. Uh, this is part two of four fall ba uh, vinyl backing. Sorry, uh, I guess two options for the shoulders, which is a, a lady. Is it a lady? Eh. Oh yeah, it's a lady. Sorry, my eyes aren't... Maybe I need readers. Um, Red Cross, I'm not gonna use that. I like the uh, silverish, the Wrecker. Uh, oh, maybe I'll use that. Not a big fan of the whole Wrecker thing because I didn't grow up with it, but uh, I think it would fit uh, this bulkhead. And uh, so that's one sheet. I have another sheet. Uh, that's on foil really good and here it says caution but just half of it so I don't know maybe it's part of another set of decals another vinyl set a big American star I'm guessing it's American uh, Red Cross option again so skip that it's good and then you have three sets of windows and I guess Okay, so you have this window is different because of the corner, and then you have two. Why are they putting two? Is it because it's too hard to apply? We'll see. Um, but looks really good. All those little details in blue. Eight uh, thirteen. It's like ammo belt, but you know, you you always think it looks like something, and then it turns out to be something else. So, no, excited for that. And also, I have my new. Uh, Decal kit. Like I'm, ki I'm not gonna use all those. Probably gonna use uh, one or two. But uh, you know, for the price that it was, um, and I get all this, yeah, it's pretty good. So, all right, uh, bulkhead for looks good. You know, not much paint on uh, the green or the two-tone green, and he's uh, you know with the silver. There's gonna be stuff here. The arms too. Hopefully not the eyes, maybe the minigun, and you know, and even the alt mode, it's gonna be uh, breaking out all that green. 
Uh, I prefer this paint uh, rather than the, uh, the, the the camo one for for the wreck and roll. That's just my personal taste. I know a lot of people really enjoy that uh, the deco, and uh, that's fine. So this is a final look. I'm going to apply the decals and see what it looks like. We haven't been able to reach you. And here we are after I applied the decals. And I have to say, I had a lot of fun with this set, uh, mainly because of all the options. And also because I got to try a couple new tools. So this is um, one of the tool that came in my new kit. And I have to say that using this to push on stuff and clear out air bubbles like this, well, now it's not working on camera properly, but anyway, it did great uh, earlier. And uh, I just need to reapply uh, this one. And I figured out why there's an extra window. So here, let's see what's left. Um, extra chin piece, extra star, wreck and rule, and whatever that girl, uh, Miko. Um, I use the sorry instead. Uh, because I don't like Nico and the wreck and rule stuff like I said I didn't read this uh, those comics so I'm not too familiar with it uh, so that's what's left here there's a lot of options uh, there's an extra part for here right here this is the if you want to make him hound basically from the uh, Babers movie and so I really wasn't going to do that there's a girl tattoo here that I didn't apply I applied the other and this is an extra mirror I'll explain why I didn't use that uh, but instead of doing both uh, tattoos on both sides, uh, one window I applied these here. Uh, they go on the Wilson we'll car mode. And you have, okay, so basically this is the set, uh, the base set, let's call it that, that you can use for bulkhead. But I went with actually the more movie hound look because I like the. Uh, it looks like ammo belts on his arms and the back so he's kind of a Frankenstein and then the extra window okay if you look here and if you can you see a reflection here and that's the mirror that you have uh, if you're looking from the outside you see the back of the mirror so that's pretty cool but the difference in the other window is that there's the mirror but there is also uh, dices or anyway it looks like the shadow of dices so I didn't put that all right so what do we have that we have tons of decals on this guy first the face uh, I used the green one to make him look more like the animated version uh, I really like that and I use the silver uh, there's a gold option um, I did the uh, uh, Wrecker logo, and you have the A13. I think that's a prime reference. So yeah, this guy is gonna be a, like, like I said, the Frankenstein. Uh, you have uh, the uh, decals here. Oops, sorry, I'm off camera. I have the decals here, here, and here. Uh, extra bullets, bullet belts. Window, this part, you have those uh, headlights. You had another option. Uh, which was two golden one of the same size didn't really like that there's a decal here and on this side here uh, i don't know why it's a i don't know bumper no that's not a bumper i don't know it's just black uh, you have uh, top of the shoulder and you have a cr 1017 that probably means something if you watch more cartoons than i do uh, nothing for the balls you have a little uh, extra piece here and then under the arm you have uh, extra ammo belt or at least that's what they look like and then you have a, an extra ammo clip here uh, Blue eyes you also have tons of option for the eyes. You actually have four options. You have blue you have these here you have uh, That's the same set you have another set here So that's the a B uh, No, these this is a different one. Yeah here so you can have more uh, um, different uh, eyeballs basically uh, I went with the uh, more G1 uh, blue eyes for Autobots uh, nothing for the gun of course uh, the belt you get two decals here to make that one line and then you have those I don't know weird headlight things here and you have uh, the thigh decals uh, looks really good and then you have a little enhancement here and here you have that blue line on the shin looks good and then you have a toe enhancement here and 
well, you have a couple of pin covers. Like here. Uh, which are they? There's some here. Oh, in the back, you have four one here. Nothing for uh, the inside here that I saw. And, but because there's a, he's a more expensive set. Uh, there's a lot of options, but there's a lot of leftovers. I'm not, I'm not too fond of leftovers. I wish Toy Hacks could do uh, like two sets, you know, one with option A, one with option B. But then if you have too many options, I guess, you know, you want some of the option A, some of the option B. So anyway, uh, there's no perfect solution. Uh, nothing for the back of the legs or what will be the bed of the truck. And yeah, that's, I think I covered this all. Uh, well, you have the decals here on the sides, the Autobots logo, so, uh, but uh, that's gonna show more in truck mode. So there you go, final, oh, for the shield. The shield you have, well, this will all translate well in truck mode. And you have here the little picture of, sorry. I like that, that's, that's uh, cool. And then you have those little announcement here and here on the side and that's pretty much it so there you go final look at bulkhead uh, after the decals and now let's go to out mode you know what i can't figure out why would anyone want to transport to this all spark forsaken sector in vacuo mode I, I get angrier because i don't like the transformation it's just the leg part it's just kind of weird uh, but it, he looks really good i mean the window clear window no Kind of, you can kind of see seats where the arms are, like it could be a seat, but uh, it's not. And then you have the extra tires here, which, uh, you know, they just fold in the back and then they're shown here. Uh, but it's really green. It's like what I would think the Hulk would look like if he was a car. But uh, yeah, it's uh, it could use uh, more paint. So I know I'm gonna have some fun decals with the window and everything. So looking forward to that. Uh, he rolls really well, and uh, yeah, so there you go with the uh, bulkhead and uh, the alt mode. So let's take a look at it with uh, decals. Oh, my head gasket. <sighs> what the? And now here we are after I applied the decals, and he looks really good. I love what Toy Hacks did with uh, this kit. First thing you're noticing is this, the big uh, stripes. You have options to have them just uh, white stripe, uh, not stripe, white stars. Uh, and uh, you know, that would look good too. And, uh, but this is, uh, I don't know, more American. Uh, but uh, that's what I'm used to seeing on TV. You know, when I watch movies, that's usually something like that that we see. You have here the girl, the, the you know, womanizing poster or whatever. But then on the other side, I chose to use the uh, the window one. So, you know, just to balance it out. You have a little decal here uh, for a grill, the Autobot logo, nice uh, windows here, really nice windows here. And uh, you have the Wrecker logo, the 813. Uh, you have the headlights. And uh, what else do you have? Well, on the tank you have this fantastic, uh, it looks like a keypad, so I guess you, uh, you can press some uh, numbers and, uh, you know, open a safe or something, but that's a gas tank, so I don't know. Kind of weird, but uh, looks good. And you have, uh, this is not just tail lights, you have all that black brown section here uh, to apply and it goes right there. And uh, yeah, and then you have this stuff inside that's uh, not so hidden. Uh, what else you have? Oh yeah, on top you have uh, these uh, steel plates that you add and then that thing here. And uh, that, uh, I don't know, just, uh, it's the same design under. It just uh, looks great. And then you have that, that cover here. Instead of having a big black piece, you have uh, this uh, green one. And then you have uh, two decals here for uh, those vents and uh, this other type of vent here uh, gets uh, this decal so pretty good oh you have the mirror and the cool thing I discovered is that it's molded differently so okay here it's molded differently like the top is different and this is not the same and then you have that line here that you don't have here so the right side when you look at it this way the right side is different and same thing for the mirror there's a decal for the mirror here, and this mirror is actually straight out. This one's on an angle. And that's, it doesn't rotate, it's molded like this, and 
but you can't really put a decal on there because it's not large enough. But I think it's cool that they have this asymmetrical uh, way to mold uh, bulkhead. The rest is pretty much identical everywhere. It's just, I don't know, that's just a little added feature. So that's pretty cool. So there you go. Final look at bulkhead and alt mode. No sign of activity. <laughs> and I'm gonna do my final thoughts by starting with my French word of the day, militaire, because he's a military truck and militaire means military. That's an easy one, guys. You should be able to remember this one. There's no quiz. Okay, so uh, final look. He looks awesome. I love all the de details and uh, that this uh, the shield looks a little better. Wish there was a better handle. Uh, you have here the little picture so that, uh, you know, when he's beating people down, you can have a smile while thinking of uh, his friend. And uh, I, I really liked, uh, you know, maybe I Frankensteined it a little bit, but uh, I'm not disappointed. Uh, he looks great and he's going to look great uh, and he's going to look great on the shelf. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this review. If you did, please like, subscribe and hit the bell. Also, leave a comment. I love reading those. And remember, nothing in life gives you a right to be an asshole. Take care.